So Elementor just had their web forward 2025 and I just wanted to cover some things. Here's the site planner and what Elementor is actually showing us here during this live stream is that they're creating a site planner that can help you out with creating briefs, sitemaps and wireframes. What got me most excited was the AI to get the brief. You can upload a brief or you can let AI generate a brief asking you conversational questions or it can listen in to the conversations you have on the Google Meets. That on itself is very amazing because that's something that I haven't seen other tools do. So I'm very excited for that one. Next is their creation of a sitemap. And to me, it feels like it's something similar to Reloom. If you are not familiar with Reloom, Reloom is an AI generator that creates a sitemap for you. It has sitemaps, wireframes, style guides. So the sitemaps and wireframes is something similar that Elementor AI is also doing. Let me show you how it looks in Reloom. So this is the uh, dashboard of the Reloom. And when we create a new project, you can have uh, you have an introduction and you can start building here you can build your sitemap yourself or you can ask ai to describe it i want a number of amount of pages and also the language to english now the room the ai will generate the pages and the sections for me and it does this by the best possibility it can you have your hero section features and benefits and if you would like to change something or would like to add something you can either click on it and you can change what's in there and you can uh, add another section and you can also generate the rest of the pages uh, because it hasn't been generated by default for now now if you are interested in the wireframe you click the wireframe button and you see the wireframe right here now i am on the free version so the other pages won't be generated only the home page will be generated. Now, when we look at Elementor's version, it looks quite similar, right? We have the uh, sitemap right here. Uh, let's zoom in a little. We have the sitemap right here. Another sitemap overview right here that is, has been generated and unaltered by the persons. And then you can create a wireframe. That looks quite similar. But the big difference is that Reloom only works with Webflow or React. Uh, as you can see, Webflow and React. But Elementor works with Elementor. Now in their video they added a QR code. I will leave a link in the description down below where you can find and test out the site planner. Let's put in the same prompt as we did for our Reloom project and let's generate. Let's see what kind of content it comes up with. Now you need to use Chrome for this one. I tried to use it with Edge and it didn't work. So let's press generate. And it asks us to sign up. So I will do that real quick. <laughs> and it will create your brief. Now here we're together creating a brief with our AI generator. What's the name of the client or your YouTube website? It's Deggy's Reviews. What's the primary goal? Showing the content, helping the video content as a companion website. What is your secondary goal with the, the, your website? It is monetization. I would like to monetize the content at a certain point. What are the core features? Uh, video gallery, a place to get pre-made pages and templates. And quite possibly a community overview. And different landing pages. What tone of voice do you want? <laughs> I want casual and some some way of engaging, <laughs> like I do most of my content, of course. Uh, can you provide a site a site map with a list of pages to be included on text review? Home uh, tutorials, templates, and uh, let me have a look. Home. Uh, uh, let's add about contacts and a shop let's keep it as this and let's see where it, what this guess gets us what's the specific range of the audience mine is a little bit older than normal what is the gender uh, now predominantly believe in male before we continue we have enough information to use brief would you like to generate site map yes Let's create the sitemap. So this is a very good experience where you can um, 
Use AI to create the brief. It asks good questions to know if it has information, what kind of deeper dive you can get, and then it creates a sitemap. Now, this looks very similar to Reloom we just saw. And here we get our pages. So it looks and feels quite similar. So if you're using Reloom already, this will be uh, quite the same. You can add a section and there are pre-made sections for the pages. And on the page itself, you have some headers with some information that talks about the information that will be shown in that section. And let's go to wireframe and let's see what kind of wireframe it generates based on the information it has. I already see a lot of AI words in there like unleash. Unleash is one of the uh, most word or cutting edge, elevate. So the text, I, I can already quickly see that the text isn't perfect, but yeah, that's something you need to adjust yourself, right? Uh, but you get an idea on how the website should look like and what kind of information would be in there. Um, it does uh, your next watch awaits and give you some idea on how it could look and good feel. And yeah, it looks quite similar to Reloom. Uh, it generates more templates, more wireframes. So that's really nice. It feels like there's some <laughs> headings missing, but it's something that you need to fill in with a copywriter. Please use a professional writer for this uh, to make sure that you're creating something perfect. If you think you're okay with this, the next step will be style, style wireframes. They are not available right now. And Renewum has something similar. And then we can export our kit. And we'll be generating our Elementor kit that we can import in Elementor. Now, I must say that this experience was quite easy and quite nice to have. Uh, I see that there could be improvements, but wait, this is the first release version. So I can see this in 2025 becoming much better than what it is right now. And I like how easy it is to use and that it exports to Elementor readily so we don't have to wait if everything is working or that we still need to do some tweaking uh, that's something you would expect when you create something with ai but you get your wireframes and from the wireframes you can create designs now one opportunity there would be to export it to figma because as a ux designer i use figma for all designs and i like to do the design elements in there as well. So making small changes, design accents like eye candy. Um, so yeah, but my first impression, it looks very good. It looks, it feels very useful and I'm very curious how it will uh, be coming in the future. Yeah. And as always, thank you for watching and keep designing. Bye bye.